So let's start with Samantha. She's extremely um, photogenic. Yeah, she's extremely. She's beautiful. And I really felt she tried and she delivered. I think she's safe for now anyway. Okay, Leighton. Do you know what? I don't think I've seen an amazing shot of her in all the time that we've been in this competition. I also think that you don't want a model walking in with a face like a smacked ass every time she's come to a challenge. I really like her. She has all the bits and that's really important. You can't be a model without being beautiful. Elise. That is the most unbelievably bad shot of what could be a beautiful girl. No, Talking sorry. about attitude, you know, we don't want her to we eat her way to the top. It's <laughs> not what we're looking for and that's what she's been doing. Let's move on to Jamie. I really loved her, her healthy body, but on the shoot, she certainly didn't perform like as, as well as I expected of her. Demelza, she is totally safe in my book this week. Uh, yeah. I okay, everybody, just be quiet for one second because I'm going to say something. <gasps> Demelza was fabulous this week. <gasps> Shock horror. <laughs> <laughs> I hated saying that. But I've said it. Okay, so Rebecca, Rebecca. I don't think she's safe at all. I think she's secretly dead. No, and they're she's just safe not, for nah, me. I don't think so is at beautiful. All. Is she a poor man's Me Megan Gale? I think she oh, could be. That's a little bit harsh. So maybe we should give her another couple of weeks to prove herself. I think so. it's too little, too late. No, she's yeah. too gorgeous. She's, she's not she's safe for me. Okay, Alexandra. Look, I think she does have good. Bits. Is she safe or is she not safe? <laughs> is she safe bit. or is she not safe? To me, she's not safe. Not safe. I think she's safe. Karis. Woohoo! A beautiful Who wants shot. to join my club? Yeah, I Who love, wants to join I the fan club? Fan I'm in the club. Number one of, of her. She Love. was just, she looks like an international supermodel without even trying. I'm You're sorry. Not going to argue with I that. just loved her, loved her, loved her. That's it. Do we agree? Absolutely no. not. No. Well, it's all too Absolutely. bad. Absolutely. Let's get the girls back in. We have decided to up the stakes. Next week, we're taking you on an exotic overseas trip. Think tropical islands. A five-star luxury resort. But in my hand, I have only six tickets. That means we will be losing two of you today. I have all of your photographs here except two. The name of the two girls I don't call will not go any further to becoming Australia's next top model. Karis. You're still in the running to become Australia's next top model. Demelza. Sam. Sam, congratulations, you're still in the journey. Alexandra. I won't butter you up or sugarcoat this. Play it fair. Thanks, Alexandra. Rebecca. You have an amazing face, legs and skin. So we've been waiting for your beauty to collide with modeling. But for today, you're still in the game. So congratulations, you're still in the running to become Australia's next top model. Well done, honey. Elise, Jamie and Layden, please step forward. Elise. In the past, we've seen confidence go to your head, but in front of the camera, it goes to your hips. You need to watch that and stay out of the kitchen and get into the gym. Jamie, 
This week was all about movement. With your amazing body, bombshell looks and dance experience, we saw great things from you this week. But you didn't bring any of these qualities to your photo shoot. Layden, we've told you time and time again that you have what it takes to be a great model. Unfortunately, your self-doubt and your attitude has kept you from letting your beautiful self shine. We're sick of your constant moodiness. The name of the two girls I don't call must make their way back to the house, pick up their bags and leave the competition immediately. <laughs> Congratulations, you're still in the running to become Australia's next top model. <laughs> Jamie and Layden, I'm sorry guys that your journey ends here. You've been so wonderful though, both of you. for me to go home than stay in this competition because it was driving me insane. Photos have come out pretty good, so who knows? I just got an okay photo, so I guess that's what let me down and I disappointed them because I thought I'd do better. And my regrets are pretty much not taking it as seriously as I should have because the reason why I got eliminated today wasn't because of my photos, but because of my attitude. Hopefully. Like the future holds modelling for me, I really want to continue modelling. I reckon Alex is going to win it, but I want Demelza to win. <laughs> she's hot and the other ones. I'd kill myself if Elise won. I think Karis or Alex will win. I want Demelza to win. Same with Layden. I don't know, I love Demelza. Please fasten your seatbelt because next Tuesday we will be experiencing some turbulence. If you're not performing this way, you may as well say goodbye. They've scored a Fijian fantasy trip, oh, but there's trouble in paradise. This is the biggest piece of sh. I don't reckon 19 year old girls cry about that sort of stuff. I don't know how much more I can put in. The bitch Katia does a flyby. I'm just wondering why she's still here. I'm gonna kill her. But who's really taking off? She looked. Amazing. And who should be strapping on the life jacket? It's the toughest elimination yet. It's too hard this week. All new Australia's Next Top Model, next Tuesday, 7.30. Exclusive to Fox 8.